probably not. What are you doing? I didn't know. Didn't Screw even know this, you were coming. Dude. I was just coming outside. I think this thing's struggling with the mud tires on there. You're getting stuck. They're I wasn't stuck. They're bald. They're bald. Do you see? Nothing. This thing still gets traction. Got the pitter. Look at all that snow in the back of the truck. You should have just leaned it over. You didn't even have to strap the thing down. I'm not you, Tyler. Serious. Look at my truck over here. I have like an avalanche. One of those, I don't know what they are, whatever. It's like a half bad truck SUV type truck. Alrighty, well, we're gonna get this thing all warmed up. A good foot, foot and a half overnight. Woo! This snow's no joke. Gotta shovel out all the snow in the back. Good enough. A little spot. I'm just gonna lean it over. Not even gonna bother strapping it down. Ryan, take it over. No, you got it. <laughs> oh, struggling in this thing. Put it in that thing. I drop it. <laughs> yeah, stock. You got an eight-inch lift. That's it. We're good to go. Okay. It's one plus to having snow. Not having to strap it. Just throwing it in the back. Actually, take that back. There's no plus of snow. But today. We're going to ride pit bikes. I'm so out of breath from shoveling. I'm really out of shape. But uh, yeah, we're going to ride pit bikes at uh, the last, I think the two videos ago. Uh, it's called the Pines. Hopefully it didn't snow a lot in there because of all the trees. But like I said, we got a good foot. And uh, it's really, really thick, really wet snow. So we'll see how they do. No studs in that. I probably should put studs back in the tires. Probably help out, but we're just going to run it because I'm sure the snow is going to melt here in like a week or two. I see it's going to be sloppy. And uh, we're just going to mess around and have a little fun today. Well, we'll see how this goes. I don't know where we're going. I guess we gotta park in here or something, but I think Ryan's just winging it, honestly. Straighten out. Woo! Well, of course, I'm in a ditch. I thought this whole thing was a driveway. Look at how deep I am in that right now. Look at this. Hey. I didn't know that was just the width. I'm done. Oh yeah. Done, done. I'm done. That's a ditch. I'm done. Sick. Like me. I was That's out. deep. So that's what I figured. That's a going. good two or three feet deep. I think I should take traction off. Keep going. Keep going. All right, stop, stop. Go backwards. Almost hit your truck. Yeah, you're tearing up the grass. Oh my god. <laughs> Stock. Eight inch left. Look at the clearance. I. Am Keep going. You. <laughs> We're good. You hear that intake go? We're no, good. you're in the road. I get my tailgate down. All right, stop. Well, that could have been a lot worse. I'm surprised I did get stuck, but that was a good two, three feet, right, Ryan? About that ditch Bro, to get out. It's packed out right down. It's though, so it's packed. Going. Yeah, it looks way. It's all. It's all in the fun for today. All right. Well, I guess we'll unload the pit or see how it does. I'm sure in the woods it's gonna be a little bit not as deep as over here, but I guess I'll test run it over here before Ryan gets his stock pitter out. It's off. Awesome. It's packed with a little snow. <laughs> a little snow? <laughs> you put your It'll blow there, out. Still... Not jetted prop. <laughs> That's all it is. Like was running a twist of the throttle. Throttle got stuck, just hitting rev limiter. It's because this little piece on the throttle kit was like screwed all the way in and the cable tension was knocked off a little bit, so. Of course, it's doing that same thing again. 
turn off your idle last time? No, it just cleared itself out. Well, I'm just going to let this thing idle out. Hopefully, the filter will dry out a little bit. And uh, Ryan's going to take out his bike. and It's going to <laughs> No way. There we go. Now it just cleared itself out, I think. again. What happened? My bolt came loose. Your exhaust is about to fall off? Nah, uh, bolt's just a little loose. Yeah. <laughs> Your fire's pushed yeah, all the way forward. We got some snowmobilers. <laughs> Dude. Oh, man. Come back. There you go. Just muscle the thing out. There you go. That was <laughs> How did that even happen? <laughs> All right, slow it up. Let's go. All right. Thing is silent. Whoa! Jeez! <laughs> What's wrong? It's making a noise when you turn to the left. Really? It goes. Yeah, it rattled a little bit with me too. It oh. seems like it doesn't turn all the way. It's. Thing is so quiet. I'm gonna head out, bike's all loaded up, and uh, unfortunately I didn't get to ride it a lot. What are you gonna do? Throw it in the garage and wait till it gets warm again, I guess, I don't know. All right, well, this whole vlog, this whole day was a joke. I thought I was gonna be able to ride, but um, of course, problems. It wasn't the air filter took the air filter off. It's gotta just be the jetting, because it's so cold, and all the, it was like really icy around the car. But we'll see if I can get out of here this time without getting stuck. Hopefully we don't, we're in four wheels, so we should be good, as long as I don't slide off in the ditch over here. Action all the way off. If you guys have a Ford, you gotta hold down the, the traction control button for like 10 seconds for the, it's to turn all the traction control off. Yeah, I'm just getting myself stuck even more. Let me get out and look. Let me close Ryan's gate, so if I pull forward, I don't hit it. Yeah, it's just digging down. I'm just digging myself deeper. Digging a hole for myself. Sick. Actually, I think under this snow, I do have a shovel. Well, good thing I kept this in the back. Well, I guess I'll try to shovel my way out. Well, I dug out in the back and the front down to the dirt, so I'll give this another go. Woo! We got it. We got it. Somehow, I thought I was gonna get stuck again, but uh, I guess he's skimming the pond or something. I don't know. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Little wheelie action. The 
problem is I can't get enough speed. And then over, no, I'm not doing that. Last time, well, yeah, last time when I came over here, I almost hit the tree, so I had to let off, and then I sunk it. Are you serious? <laughs> you got the long ways. You can do it long ways. Two up. Whoa! Three up? That's a bad idea. Three people? <laughs> Are you going? How <laughs> so many wallets do you have? Oh my. Here we go. Whoa! Somehow. Well, that was very unexpected, a uh, little addition to the vlog here. So we got three up. If anybody has ever gotten four up on a sled, water skipping, DM me on Instagram, at Tyler Monaghan. I want to see it because I don't think it's possible to water skip with four people on there for that fourth person to not fly off the back. So send it to me. I want to see it. If anybody out there has done it, I'm not sure yet. I haven't looked on YouTube or anything like that, but I'm sure somebody has out there. If you guys like that, give the video a thumbs up and uh, hit the subscribe button if you're new to see more content like this. Kinda. I mean, I want the snow to melt so we don't have content like this, but also it does make for pretty funny content. Get a little drift action pulling into the driveway. Alright, we're good. Alright, so I think I'm going to end the video here. If you guys enjoyed the snowmobile, some of the pit bike, not much. I know I got a little GoPro and whatnot. Definitely hit the subscribe button down below. Give this video a thumbs up. Share with all your snowmobile buddies, your pit bike buddies, whatever. And off of that, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully, hopefully, I know a lot of you complained in um, yesterday's video about not having the uh, the build series video on the KX125. It's coming. It just, if it doesn't come out Sunday morning at 10 a.m., it'll come out Monday for sure. And then immediately after following that, get the vapor hone. And then hopefully by then, I should have uh, the parts in to rebuild the motor, that whole deal. So I'll update you guys that in the next build series video. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one.